Hey guys, what's up? Kevin here for yet another video, and welcome to a very special on paper, uh, a very special episode on Paper Mario Sticker Star. Like you're seeing in the title, I have finally achieved 100%. Sorry that this video took a while to upload, but uh, I've uh, I have been you know a little busy with college and you know not a lot of time to play and get you know my leftover two achievement flags. But I already got them, so let's go ahead and you know j just show you what you get for getting uh, you know just 100% in the game. Uh, this is actually my second take of the episode. I mean, <laughs> uh, well of the this video right here because uh, it ended up being like nine minutes and for me to show I mean <laughs> for me to uh, only show my 100% achievement I think that was a little bit too overboard um, the first thing that I want to show you is uh, what you get for completing the uh, sticker museum as you see right here there are two sides of it uh, two sides of it um, the blue side is actually the thing stickers and the orange side is the battle stickers so I want to go ahead and you know, just uh, show you what ha well what happens if you complete all the battle stickers is not really that great uh, you're going to be spending one coin uh, to look at this which is actually a cheap ass um, if you get over here you will notice that you're only going to see how some of the enemies attack it's not really that great I mean I don't think we've <laughs> we fought a lot of these things and the you know in the main LP uh, like for example we didn't really fight the uh, the ninja whatever no I think we did so you know, this one is not that great. I mean, um, the only thing that you get to see is how the enemies attack. You can't really get to interact at all. You go, you know, by the world or any, uh, in the, you know, in that stuff. So you go from the uh, regular, uh, regular land to the desert, to the woods, to the icy lands, and then to the jungle. Um, if you complete the, um, well, the thing sticker aside of whatever, uh, you're going to get to hear a couple of soundtracks. Uh, you don't start in this one. I already, you know, listened to some of them, which uh, if you want to go ahead and do, I'm going to have like a, 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 well, I suppose game episode on Sticker Star. I'm going to have a full guide on where to get all the things. So we don't really need to look at, you know, or listen to, uh, you know, all of these songs. But um, I'm going to keep quiet for a couple of seconds, you know, to uh, just to show you some of them. And that's pretty much it. So, um, while we go to the main area to see my accomplishments flags, um, if you want my opinion on the rewards that you get for doing all this work, it's not really worth it. I mean, I, I really did it because I enjoy the game and I enjoy, you know, the, the, the completion side of games. I really like, you know, completing my games to 100% and this one was really, really fun to do. However, the rewards are not really worth it. I mean, I think they're a little bit lame, but uh, again, in the previous Paper Mario's, what do you get for completing, you know, a game 100%? You don't really get anything. So, in that aspect, uh, this game is actually better than, you know, its uh, predecessors because, you, you know, this is the only Paper Mario where you get some Something for completing uh, one of the aspects of, uh, of the game to 100%. So um, after that, let's go ahead and check out the accomplishment flags and you know, just uh, show you all the stuff, um, which is actually pretty uh, you know straightforward. There are eight flags for you to get, and they are. Um, Getting 100% of the H of the HP up hearts, getting 100% of the stickers, which we which I already showed you, getting 100% on, secret, on uh, secret doors, and getting 100% in common pieces, comet pieces. So uh, right here we have the 10,000 coins. Right here we have the 500 perfect bonuses, and we have a uh, well the th uh, the 1,000 excellence, and right here we have the 50 jackpot. So um, if I mean, like I said before, if you want my opinion, these, you know, uh, well, these rewards are not really that great, but again, when in the, you know, Paper Mario games do you get something for completing, you know, which is one of the aspects of the game to 100%, but I think this is, you know, really, really awesome to show off, and that's really, really cool. Uh, the playtime for this file is actually 27 hours and 19 minutes. I know it can be done, you know, a lot shorter, but uh, it actually took a couple of minutes to figure out since this is my main file. I just went ahead and played blind. Uh, if you go through the game a second time, I think it can be done in under 20 hours, which is really awesome, and I'm definitely going to go ahead and do that. So... Uh, if you guys actually want to leave me a comment saying, uh, you know, just if you already have 100%, which I know that some of you are, uh, that some of you guys already have, uh, just leave a comment saying uh, how long did it take to, uh, you know, just getting your awesome 100%. 
And, um, yeah, I mean, if you really want to know anything else, just leave it in the comments, because I think this is pretty much it for this episode, and, um... Yeah, I don't think there's anything else for you know for us to do. So if you guys enjoyed the episode, make sure to you know just give it a like and leave me a comment if you already achieved the 100% in the game and how long did it take you to do it. And um, yeah, without any further ado, you guys have a great day. Take care of yourselves, and until my next episode when we get to continue with the Paper Mario Sticker Star LP and the story exploring the world uh, five five. I will see you then.